Good morning and welcome back to Tiki Town, to the treasure hunt. Um, we did a little exploration tour last night through the city here. And uh, there's a lot of shops in this area where we assume the American Legend shop, I think it's called, is. Where the whole baseball card situation will come to its conclusion. No, not to its, to its climax, let's put it this way. Um, so I think my plan is we're going to drive up here, park somewhere around here and start clearing out the center. There's a lot of zombies there. Um, not huge hordes, but definitely something that needs clearing and we can't just sneak into the store and sneak out. Yeah. And side objective is still to eventually get a Welding mask. So maybe there's a tool hardware store or something on the town. And of course, we're still looking for um, a couple of cards to complete our collection. Hello. Sorry. Yeah, I guess this is the, these are all the guys we kind of dragged along last night, but they weren't able to follow us all the way back to base. Now I'm carefully killing them all in the middle of the road to make driving here a little bit more pain. I also need one more repeater map fragment. I actually packed in the ones we have, put them in the inventory so we can uh, complete the map as soon as we find it. Let's um, push up here. Now we are actually a little getting a little bit chubby here. So of course, you know, if you need to watch what you're, what we're eating, some snow globes seems like the perfect choice. Completely empty, okay. Not sure what I expected. I feel like if you have a concealed carry purse with you, not having anything in it is kind of counterproductive. Actually, now uh, I know that we looked at the sporting goods store before and I decided not to go in. But I forgot that we have the aluminium baseball bats. I want to say 05 is one we still need. Not anymore. And yeah, getting more of those might be worth a little, little detour. Hashtag totally not getting distracted. It's just, it's just a sporting goods store, right? How long? How long can this detour actually be? It sounds like a bunch of guys coming through that door any second now, so let's make it quick. Regular bats? No. Okay. 
35. Down to the last six cards. What's this here? Oh, rolls. One we already got. Take some ammo. I'm not even sure if I'm taking more more pistols at this point. And at some point, I need to look through all the weapons we have and make a decision which ones to keep and which ones to just get rid of. Oh boy. Oh boy. Hello. I mean, yeah, hashtag totally not getting distracted, but that is, that is a hello officer. Come on. Come on, game. I mean, I do have... I did have a Slim Jim with me yesterday. Where did I drop that now? Military fanny pack. First things first, um, we're gonna need some, need some beta blockers. So I'm walking in a direction that is not clear. Okay. Would you just follow me? Not have fence jumping, please. Makes me nervous. On one hand, I like I like the quest idea. On the other hand, I like having uh, I really don't like looking for every single zombie to see if they have that one item we still need. It's like very very tedious and getting very old very quickly. It's like at the start of the game, you have to do this for stuff like um, watches, right? Uh, get your electrical skill up. But then once you stop doing that, you at some point stop caring about zombie loot. And I think that's okay. I think that's that's part of the progression in Zomboid, where you know at the start you need everything. At some point you stop looting zombies. At another point you stop looting residential houses because you don't need anything from there. But. Moment, we're not there yet.
Hmm. This is barricaded here. What's up with that? Okay. Put a big note on the on the map here. That's probably some sort of pawn shop. Also hit bits within there. Uh, if you guess there's one more car zone team we can watch. Also, I should totally have taken a rest after the big group. And we get a little bit of rest in just from walking around instead of running around, right? enough of a rest. Yeah. Oh, I can't rest on these. Oh, terrible place. Gonna give a terrible Yelp review. Can't even rest on the chairs there. We're gonna do an unusual rest. We're gonna rest in the car. Oh, hang on. Did I, did I leave the Slim Jim in the back? Yes, there it is. Okay. Surely those guys are far enough away and they're not gonna spot me. I'm sneaky. Sneakiest survivor in the city. Also the only one. I feel like there could be better feedback um, based on that mod, like if you manage to open it or not. I think there's some sort of sound cue telling you if it was successful or not, but that sound is like we're in. Needed to rest anyway. I'm sitting while I'm doing this. Just take a quick look at you. Ah, the condition could be better. Well, it's just the seats, right? The rest seems mostly green. Engine 65% and what? 95 quality. No gas. This might be our new main ride. Because first of all, we're a police officer. So I think that's just fitting. And second of all, good horsepower so we can um, more easily drag the trailer through the um, through town. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Okay, anyway. So 
think it just makes sense to push down here through this main parking lot. It's enough room, we're not fighting here next to some trees. Plenty of room to fight, good line of sight. And room to ru run away if there's a runner coming, like that guy. Up here. Uh, Eleven, no, twenty nine, yes. You shouldn't try to adjust your notes while walking. Did that guy really just walk past the broken window to the next... I tell you, these zombies, they have something against windows. Uh, number 12? No? Cigarettes? Yes. Annotated map. Very quick, much rich. Eh? Right. Yeah, whatever. If you can't figure it out, I'm not gonna help you. You'd think with only five cards left, I would be able to remember those and not have to constantly look back at this. No, it's not, not absolutely not. It's not how my mind works. A sledgehammer here. I hear a bunch of windows breaking. I don't like that. There's some offices above. So my hope was that this would lead me into, yeah, exactly, this place. It's more like a military surplus store, I guess. A mini clothing. Not on the flashlight. these windows. Just a little bit curious here. Let's quick check upstairs. It's a nice little place here. I don't assume you're like a secret um, welding mask enthusiast. He needs to walk in wardrobe. Okay. 
pistol another What do we got away in? Pink kitten. Let's eat a half pack of mac and cheese. Yeah, trying to not overeat here. Just tell me we're not going up, we're not going up. I'm just gonna grab a few quick electric wires and stuff. And then... Give me, give me the hand eyes. That, oh, that's just the wire and the other one. Yeah, that's a that's a fair amount of, of guns and ammo, I guess. Not insane amounts, tactical sickle. So there's actually not that much stuff here. <laughs> Take a closer look at it. Uh, hey, it's fine. Um, mental notes, we're gonna pick some stuff up at a later date. Just wanted to check this out here, over here. Make sure to look both ways when crossing the street. And continue on to engage the zombies ahead. No hugs, no hugs. We're still missing one Louisville map, so I should probably occasionally check those. Though it's not it's not the end of the world if we don't have it. One fourteen, nineteen, twenty-five, thirty-one. I mean, that's also a nice car. Uh, at least it looks like it's in nice condition over there. Oh, now it's pump. Should take a take a rest here. Sit on ground. So tempted to check the car condition here, but I also know that 
that will probably then be one the one car that has a car alarm in it, and then everything we've done today is gonna be for nothing. Same thing here, good old police cruiser. You guys sitting there. It's like, ah, these shops we couldn't really make out um, when we were driving past, so I wanna get a look at those. If we have the time, also take a look at the police station. Look at that West Point. All right, we're down to four missing cards. Let me. This one I take the weapon this time, well, because it had also a magazine in it, and always good to have more magazines for quick change. No idea what the lower sign is saying. Oh, repeat that map fragments. So that should mean if I read the map now. We have the four stations. So it's Rosewood, March Ridge, West Point, and then outskirts of Louisville. No, that's inside Louisville. That's inside the, the, the fence line. And the fence line goes here along this. Uh, this is the burnt down city. Yeah, yeah. So I think this is the corn maze. That's like a. Oh God, there's. there's this. Ah, it's one of the places you just don't want to be in the game. They're like, yeah, no thanks, I'm good. Alright, it's more like a, a music store. Number nine earlier today. This looks promising, I want to say. Hello. American Legends. He's no house alarm. Not a window we can open, is it? No, it is. Right, so money, 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 money. Baseball card box. 
look for cards. So I, I'm assuming you need to have all the cards and then you can put them in the box. Look for some cards to put in here. And This is the shop where you go when if you want to buy some money. Hmm. I guess it would be too easy if the cards were in the shop, huh? No, oh, there are some cards in here. All right. We need 14, 19, 25, 31. 5. Now, I'm going to look like such a fool if you could just get a full collection from the shop. Uh, what was that? We just picked up 19? That's 31. Uh, uh, 14. I can I can remember it at this point, I think. Maybe. In here. And it's not in here. Oh god. <laughs> Missing one card. Uh, please tell me you have some in storage. No, that's not a storage. And that is probably also not the sign you normally put on a storage room. All right, number 14. And then my assumption is, um, or if I understand correctly, you can then put it in the box. Put it in the box. Um, and then you get some sort of treasure map. Thank you, Mickey. Anyone here has a number 14? It was smart to have their cells right next to the exit door, so if somebody does a daring escape, they have an easy way out. Oh no, we're getting tired. Ah, ah. Let's, let's drink a tonic. Like I want to do a quick look through the police station here. School classroom. Should I go on? Probably the interesting room. Just make sure we're not getting any surprises from up top. So I think, I think I should totally get a fresh set of police clothes here. Yeah. They have anything. They only have shirts. They they don't wear pants in this police station. The hell is that? Statue. Oh yeah, no, obviously. Ah, deputy pants. Mm. 
when we take trooper pants, so, you know, we're gonna take 556 five, drum magazines and ammo. The jacket has combat speed modifier, boo. Um, dismantle the radios here. Okay, and we're gonna carefully throw everything on the ground again that we don't need. Thank you. No friends, where do you keep your welding masks? Probably the wrong place for that. Hmm. Sounds like there's more than one. Just the blinds. Nobody needs to see what's about to happen here. It's, it's not a lot. We need more, more pants. Do I take stuff with me now? Yeah, I think we're gonna head home here after this. So let's just grab all the stuff that I think might be useful later on. Fourteen shots for the shotgun. Actually, two five seven. I'm not gonna take. Archer, sure, maybe three five seven is a great caliber and actually useful, but I can't. I can't take every single weapon. All grim weapon light. Double stack extended magazines. That is for another silencer. That is to repair some weapons. CO2 cartridges. Which I want to put my faith into some CO2 powered weapons. Laser device. Pew pew. Uh, what else we have? Eight. Standard magazines. Magazines. Okay, we have five, oh five of six drum magazines. Yeah, now we're talking. Now we're also slightly encumbered, heavy load. Uh, let's grab the rest of the... Well, first of all, put this away. Um, let's eat the rest of the mac and cheese. So we're lightly over, slightly over. Maybe if we eat some chips, then we get the well-fed buff. Okay. Taking the shortcut out. Somewhere in this direction is my car. I left the engine running the whole day. I 
here. Okay, no, oh, sorry guys, but we don't have, don't have time for your shenanigans. I'm I'm heading home. Let's drop everything in here. I'm getting actually to the limit of the storage capacity of this trailer, which is fine. Which I'm totally okay with. Let's put it in here for now. Just wondering if I should uh, keep the repeater zones map like one version on me. Because like, I don't think we need multiples, but um, if we lose it or if we lose access to the trailer, I kind of still want to have it. Um, right, put all of that stuff in there. Looking good. Keeping this. And I'm also now. Grabbing all the cards. Right, we're one card away. At least if my if my list is correct. She is a uh, medium-sized if. The device can go in there. Also, the... Four bottles. Did I put them all away? I think I put them away. This is all fine. This is the stuff we need, the stuff we want. Um, this has done its service. Okay. All right, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, ten, fifteen, fourteen is missing. Three, four, five. All right, cool. Um, drop on, drop on, drop on, drop on. Min maxing weight here. Yeah. Wait, is there, um, no, there's no way to actually look at these. Okay. That would be, um, um even more extreme. Anyway, getting a little bit, a little bit tired, a little bit late here. Was there a water dispenser in this place? Yes. Let's have a good night's sleep. Right, so we need one more baseball card, which we don't necessarily need to get from this place, right? We could we could just leave Tiki Town behind, then probably have to return once whenever we get uh, the treasure map, because I'm assuming the map's also going to be for here. Um, so what will we do? This sounded like an, in, uh, looked like an interesting building. I kind of want to check that out. Yeah, we still have the whole metalworking problem. Hmm. I wonder if, if in all the houses and the garages we checked on these kind of houses, if there were, was a welding mask that I just left behind that I didn't take. Could look there. 
we have this area, but there's, these are such huge buildings, so many zombies, I kind of want to ignore that. Um, well, as I said, maybe there's a hardware store or something here. I think think I'm going to go back into the center of town, you know, swing by this place, check this out, um, and then swing back here. I'm, I'm aware... So yeah, this is the other end of town. There's another residential area. Might be worth looking for survivor houses over here. And this looks like some big warehouse factory thing. Maybe maybe this is the best place for a welding mask. I know that somewhere in here there's like a bowling place slash shooting range, which you know might might be interesting. Um, I guess before we leave town, we definitely, I want to grab the other car. We can check if some of the parts, the car parts we got from the post office might be better parts for that car and can, you know, swap out some parts, increase the quality, maybe fix, uh, we can't fix the engine, we don't have the skill for that yet. Um, gotta get in the video store, maybe this the, the last tape. Um, find a generator. Power up the gas station, f refuel, right? Before we leave town, we want to be fully fueled up. So yeah, a few things back to left to do in Tiki Town, but we found the American Legend place. We got the baseball card box. And we're missing one card. And once we have it, we'll get the mystery solved. Hopefully. For now, though, I'm going to put a card in here. Thanks for watching. See you next time.